what a day this is in Lincoln, Nebraska, folks. Dial B for perfect. I mean, we're talking 60 degrees. We're talking a renewal of a classic. It's Oklahoma and Nebraska. And entrances in college football. And the sea of red. Welcome to the Cornhuskers. What he wants to. Now it is third down and seven after the loss. From the shotgun, Diedrich can't handle it. It's three and out. And there's that OU defense again. With the crowd howling. With that spread formation. He'll throw it on first down. And it's intercepted by Kramer. Kramer's got it. To the 25. The first turnover. So here's your third and long, and the Huskers have been unable to move the ball on this defense. Slant pass high, dropped. So it's fourth down, and will Solich try a long field goal here as Derek Strait? The backs are pressing the wide receivers. And the option look. And Quinton Griffin explodes to the 40-yard line on a 9 and 10 for the offense. Here's the blitz. Successful. Sacked at the 35-yard line. This third and 15. It'll be tough. Incomplete. Well, great coverage. Oklahoma forced to punt. That's Craver again, too. And Oklahoma back on the 21. Huge advantage for the Huskers. They've been unable to cash in on it. They'll try to throw. Open man. Side. They fought him out and go to a three-man line. They're expecting Nebraska to throw. They blitz a safety, and it's blocked as Roy Williams comes in. Oh, what a play by Williams. And Another big How much experience yet. The center in the middle. Time. Got Smith again. First down. Beautiful. He read his tight end coming across. Led him perfectly that time. Nice throw by Jason White. Half a field right now. Fresh set of downs, and they're at midfield. Quarterback draw. A first down. He hit the marker beautifully with Burrow in pursuit. He man looking. They've been blitzing off this. And there's two blockers back there. They're going to send him out. They release him. Here's White looking for an open man. He may take off. He'll drop it to the open man. Griffin out of a beautiful by Jason White. He made. Here's Hibble's first play. Fakes the end around, pulls back, and a toss to the end zone, tight end, incomplete, and there'll be a penalty. They'll take interference. That was going to be a touchdown that time. McPherson felt he had no other choice. Nate Hibble, who lost his job to White, has taken over. Second down and goal, going to throw for it. Tight end, wraps it up, touchdown, OU. So, off the bench, Nate Hibble drives the Sooners to their first touchdown of the game and Trent saw the tape of it afterwards Tim Duncan adds the extra point oh percent of the snaps I'll update you as well on Wistrom he's just a little lame like he was before all right Jack thank you as Crouch back. this time he gets the ball into Thomas's hands Thomas is the leading receiver that's a first down he Bring Thunder around, and Crouch pulls out to pass it again, wide open. Cross midfield, puts it in the hands of this by far the most impressive Nebraska drive of the day. Diedrich for the first down of Nebraska. Kyle Ringelberg, number 86, has been played. As Crouch comes back to Westrum. First down, his first completion of the game, and he's out of bounds inside the whisper. The ball is inside the 20. Deidre cuts for an alley and heads for the end zone. Stopped at the two-yard line by Everidge. That sets.
sets up the power game for the Huskers after that six minute outstanding running back. Eric Crouch will be looking for touchdown number 56. He already has the NCAA record. First to set Diedrich into the end zone. So he comes right back with Darren Diedrich. And the Huskers. An extra point away after an impressive drive following the OU touchdown. Just to be safe. Deadlocked at seven as Josh Brown adds the extra point. They couldn't do it running. They're down. Sooners don't want to give up field position. There's Trent Smith again. What a go-to guy he's been turned out to be. Short of the first down, though. Yeah, just short. Gross is back. Cuts back. He's got daylight. Midfield. Here he comes. Brought down at the 28-yard line from behind. Brandon Moore. Away from Rocky that time, weren't they? Second down. They'll stick with Dietrich. Hole left side. And he explodes for a first down. Just short of the 15-yard line. Matt Milt never ever forget it. We're behind you 100 percent Third Nebraska's down. Nebraska's gonna go empty backfield. Look and see if we get a quarterback draw. Here's Crouch. <laughs> Thomas juggles and held on at the 10, but he's short of the first down. And Nebraska's got the field goal unit. This for the lead. 27 yards for Josh Brown. Makes it good. Nebraska's first lead. They trailed it by seven, and they tied it to the Sooners. A strike for the first down, and he puts it in the hands of Martin Clayton, the redshirt freshman from Arlington. Center. They try to get in on Hibble. They force him out of the pocket on the move, and a diving reception at the 49-yard line by Clayton. Keeping his feet moving and shuffling over there on him. Oh, you'll learn. He's a young'un. Second down. Oh, he's got time. Got a man wide open at the 30-yard line. First down, Oklahoma, Antoine Savage. Now, remember. The matchup right here, you said to Trent Smith. for the field goal. Coming in on him was Deion Booker that time on the blitz. He got the pressure on Hibble. And, the right hash. and we are deadlocked at 10. On first down for Hibble and the Sooners. Bobbles a snap. Comes up firing. Intercepted on a beauty. Ricochet, Sweeney gets his hands on it. Turnover. What a great interception for Irwin Sweeney. The bounce. Yes, he did now. Crouch brings Thunder Collins around. He's got the corner. Look out, sideline. Tripped up from behind by Derek Strait, who saved a touchdown as Collins. Second down for the Huskers. Diedrich again. down if he could have made <laughs> Crunch has got it and OU reads it down at the 10 yard line because of Jimmy Wilkerson another negative play the goal line nickel package in for OU <laughs> Thomas has been the favorite target Crouch keeps it in trouble Oh, Diving incomplete. Whoa. Just balanced, or it was almost picked off by Matt McCoy, who came in. 26 yard field goal attempt for the lead. Josh Brown. He nails it. 
An interception into three points, but Oklahoma did not give up a touchdown down there. That's big for their defense. They need 11 yards. Booker shows blitz again. Now he, he's coming. They'll throw it up in the air. Well, incomplete as Gross turns back and makes a fabulous play on Mark Clark. Need one here. And Nebraska is forced to punt. Nebraska forced the punt as Kalmus. Matchup that has been working. There he is right there. McPherson is the defender on him. He'll try to square up, but Hibber likes to look to the left. First down at no. Clayton has grabbed it. Yes, it was a catch. On Smith, they're bringing him in the block. They agree to blitz. This is a blitz audible. Throws left deep. Incomplete. McPherson comes up big, defends the other tight end. They line up in the go? power formation here for third and two. And now Crouch is going to pull back. Wistrom overthrowing at the 30 yard line as we picked him up, checking into the lineup. We knew he was up. Trailing it by three. From the pocket, holds up a beautiful pass to Norman. At the 45-yard line, 15 yards, we check in with Jack Aroot. We'll protected pocket in the offensive line, gave him the time. Now first 10, he's got time again. Stands and delivers this time to Clayton, who slips away from Gross and makes it inside the 40-yard line. It's another first down. Two well-delivered. So on third down, Hipple's looking for that. Rolls to the right, throws against Kelsey, and he for it and pulled it in, and he uh, might have gotten another they kick it. Right. Pooch it. They're going to play for field position. And they bury him inside the five. Folks, go back to the Texas game. That's exactly what set up. Get down for Nebraska trying to come out from inside the five yard line. Pooch has got a crease. His best run of the day. Out of bounds at the 24. Eric Crouch, 19. And his biggest <laughs> on the end around the double reverse. And they're gonna throw off of it. Crouch is open. He's got it. Fingers for the end zone. They won't catch him. Eric Crouch zips into the end zone. As Mike stunts, a quarterback and a wing back, number 16. Scouted that play. Extra point is up. Got it. Third down for Hibble. Off the blitz, he's got the first down. Norman to the 40 yard line. This is defining. Is up now by 10. We're inside of five minutes. Down he goes. Jamie Burrow makes the play. Blitz from the side, but they keep Deion Booker. It's two games between these two teams. Oklahoma wins the South. What a rematch. That'll be in Dallas on December 1st. That'll be one of the great settings of all time because if Nebraska is still city number one, let's say they are, wouldn't Oklahoma love to knock them out of a shot at the... Pressure. Down at the 31-yard line, John Clanton, the nose man. Yeah, but it was Chris Kelsey that got in there first again, coming around the head coaches. They went to the middle. And that'll do it. He dropped it. Nebraska. Beats Oklahoma. They'll be talking about Frank Solich's call of Solich's career. Nebraska will stay number one in the BCS. But Oklahoma will circle December 1st, and they will say, we'll meet you in Dallas. And now Stoops will go over to shake hands.
with his counterpart on the other side. Here comes Solich. Two great football teams slugged it out. Great respect. And there's Eric Crowder.